Folks, so far we have missed the bad, bad weather. The extreme weather has been in either the western part of the United States. Check out these temperatures. Tucson, Arizona today, 84 degrees there, so very, very hot. Out to the west, 79 in Galveston, Texas, even in uh, Wyoming temperatures up in the 50s. And then, of course, New England, massive snowfalls again over Sunday night through Monday night, 15 to 30 inches of snow in the Boston area. Seven structures have already collapsed due to the weight of the snow on the roofs. They've had over 70 inches in the last 19 days. Here's our season, 12 and a half inches of snow so far this month. And for the season, 30.9, which is just below the average of where we should be right now at 31 0.6 inches of snow overnight tonight. We're watching this uh, complex coming in from the west. It's an Alberta clipper. It's a little upper air low. You can see the swirl right here. Here's the low passing through central Wisconsin. It's going to bring light snow through the area uh, and essentially it's going to be very, very light about an inch Fond du Lac and Sheboygan counties, half an inch to a trace everywhere else to the south and then even though the temperatures are relatively mild through the evening hours and overnight tonight, look at these temperatures to our north. 20 below zero Fort Smith, 20 below at Churchill, and that air mass is moving in our direction for Thursday through the weekend. So it's going to get bitterly cold. Uh, temperatures uh, through the evening and early nighttime hours will stay in the 20s for the most part. And then check it out by Wednesday. We're going to see uh, those temperatures drop overnight and then 16 below zero wind chills on Thursday morning and all day Thursday. Those wind chills will stay below zero. Here's the clipper that's bringing the light snow overnight tonight and also the cold behind it. Strong northwest winds will dictate that cold air coming in from that chilly air mass out of Canada. So overnight tonight, light snow, maybe a little sleet mixed in after midnight, cloudy skies in 23. For tomorrow, seasonal temperatures right around 31 degrees with a snow shower left over. Strong northwest winds starts that cold air coming in tomorrow night with a flurry early in five degrees and check out Thursday. We'll see some sunshine, but a high of only 10 with wind chills to 15 below zero. Our seven day forecast keeps the cold air all the way through Saturday and even into Sunday, Saturday 814 on Sunday, but by Monday and Tuesday, we'll be back in the 20s.